Homeless people in Red Bluff are on the move from River Park to Samuel Ayers Park. Action News Now reporter Chloe Curtis is live at River Park. So, Chloe, are people making that switch without complaint? Overall, yes. I was here about a month ago, and there's not even a tenth of the amount of tents and RVs that were here that last time. And some of the homeless people I've talked to that have moved over to Samuel Ayers Park say it already feels a bit safer for them as well. But the change is also noticeable for some other people in the community, including two women that I spoke with today. One of those women says today was the first time she's been to River Park in a couple of months and was surprised at how much it had changed. It's been like a couple of months, and the only reason I'm here is because I meant to take a right and I took a left. And I actually parked around the corner because the last time I was here, because I'm a single woman, I wasn't real comfortable coming over in this area. And then I walked around and I thought, wow, it looks really clean, clear over there. So I, I think it started like a year and a half ago and there was a ton of people. That, there was probably 40 tents there a couple months ago and just as many dogs. Um, and then they started slowly moving out of here and then I saw that they were moving them to Dog Island Park, but it was voluntary. And this morning was the first time I looked across the way and hadn't seen a tent, which is kind of nice. Margie Wall says she supports the temporary use of Samuel Ayers Park for the homeless and thinks if it's patrolled on a regular basis, the homeless living there might feel safer too. And the move is supposed to be temporary as the city considers other solutions to homelessness here in the city, which might also include the building of a shelter. PATH is currently working on building the city's first homeless shelter and hoping to break ground on that starting as early as next year. Live in Red Bluff, Chloe Curtis, Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. Thanks. Chloe Path is also providing one meal a day to the homeless living at Samuel Ayers Park and helping many of them move their belongings from River Park over to the new sanctioned location.